fight. What? What? What, what? is going on, everybody? Hold on, hold on. This is your captain speaking. Back with another video. Now, my name is Trey Ward. I pride myself on helping you become the best version of yourself that you can be. Perfect. And this is another video in our 30 day series on helping you develop into your better self. Now, if that's something that can resonate with you, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with somebody else you may think could use it. So I wanna go ahead and jump into today's video. As you can tell by the title, you can tell by the thumbnail. Today, we are going to be talking about consistency class and why your lack of consistency is the only thing that's holding you back from becoming the best version of yourself that you can be so without further ado class let's go ahead and get into the video so for you today in this video i composed a six-step plan to help you become not only more consistent but stay consistent and reach your goals and all that you want to accomplish so to start with that class Step one of the six step plan is recognition. You need to recognize that there is a need for you to be consistent in your life. Now, whatever goal, whatever aspiration, whatever dream you hope to accomplish, your consistency isn't going to start until you register within your mind that you need to be consistent with something that you're not improving or you're not bettering yourself because of your lack of consistency. Okay, so the second thing is a reasoning. You need a why. Why do you need to be consistent? What is it that you're trying to accomplish? You need to figure out your goal. What, well, or what, what is it your reasoning for wanting to, you know, um, be self-improve or you know, be consistent in any aspect of your life? You need to have a reason for it because if you don't have a reason for it, it'll be a lot easier to fall off. I think this one might be the most important out of all of them. You need to write a schedule. Okay, in order to be consistent, you need to put a schedule in place to help yourself be more accountable. When you have that schedule, you can see and you list everything you need to do in the day, Lord willing, of course, you can easily hold yourself accountable. And when you miss something, it hurts because you know that something is supposed to be done during that time. For example, I'm supposed to wake up at five o'clock in the morning. That's a part of my schedule. That's a part of being consistent. That's a part of my goal to do hard things to self-improve, right? And when I cannot wake up at five o'clock a.m. for any reason, it breaks my habit of consistency. And my schedule, I miss out on something and it hurts because I have something planned. And so for the next morning, I will do everything I can to make that time or make that appointment so I can stay consistent because I want to follow my schedule. Number four is networking. And what do I mean by networking? I mean, find somebody who's doing what you wanna to do to be consistent. Let me give you an example. If you wanna consistently work out, talk to somebody who consistently works out. Ask them for guidance, ask them for help, tell them what you wanna do and ask them for tips. Ask them to encourage you. Ask them to send you a text every now and then. And if you're like, Trey, I don't know, it, 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 you can find it. On Instagram, if you go to the hashtag and you type in something like gym or lifting, bodybuilding, fitness, you can find somebody who's posting about their lifestyle. You wanna be a, a consistent YouTuber, post consistent videos, hashtags, go to small YouTube community, tap in with somebody who's doing YouTube. Whatever it is that you wanna be consistent with, network and find somebody who's doing it so they can help give you guidance and help you know point you in the direction that you want to go and whatever it is that you're trying to be consistent with okay on to number five we have i hope you guys can see this affirmations right and so what is that? What do I mean by affirmation? You need to encourage yourself along this journey. Being consistent is going to be hard. I, I'm just going to be real with you. Being consistent is going to be very hard. You need to encourage yourself. You need to affirm every day that you can do this because you have a goal you want to reach and that's going to lead into, you know, step number six to be consistent. But you need to just encourage yourself. Tell yourself you can do it. You know, do whatever you need to do to keep your head in the game. Have a moment where you might need to break down, but affirm that you can do it. Affirm that you can do it, and not only that you can, you will do it, because there's somebody looking at your journey. Somebody who needs to be inspired by the hard work that you put in being consistent, so they can self-improve too. So, encourage yourself daily, affirmations. That's gonna be very important in being consistent. 
And finally, guys, we get to number six, which is tracking your progress and envisioning your success. So whatever it is that you want to be consistent at, working out, YouTube, studying, hair, getting better at basketball, making, you know, getting better at football, getting bigger, whatever it is that you want to be consistent at, you need to track your progress. Every day, strive to be better than yesterday. And write down your, vi write, write down, you know, everything that you've accomplished and then really try to push yourself every day to be better than yesterday. That's really gonna help you be consistent and it's gonna help you get results. When you see results, you're gonna to wanna to keep getting results and you're gonna to wanna to continue to be consistent. And then envision your success. Whatever it is that you're going for, whatever your goal of being consistent is, envision that success. If it's a six pack washboard apps, envision that. If it's 100,000 subscribers, envision that. If it's the dream body that you've always wanted, the physique that you want, envision that. If it's, you know, Whatever, whatever you're trying to be consistent at in life, envision that success, envision your end goal, envision your trophy, and I guarantee you, consistency will start to get easier and easier every single day. Guys, I would not tell you something that I'm not doing myself. All these things I do myself and consistency is still very difficult, but it gets easier and easier the more I apply these six steps. Now, you don't have to do them in any specific order, but for me, this has just been helping me. And on this channel, I give you what has helped me and what I'm currently doing to hopefully help you and inspire you so you can also self-improve. But my name is Trey Webb. The whole basis of this channel is to help you become the best version of yourself that you can be. Perfect. Um, I have another video coming out for you guys tomorrow, so hopefully you can be inspired. And uh, yeah, this is just a 30 day journey. We're gonna take one day at a time. And hopefully the goal by the end of this journey is so that I can become consistent and you can also learn that too. But this is your captain speaking. And I will see you tomorrow. Y'all dodged the bullet, no pop quiz today.